Hi, this is Tesla Today, where we talk about the latest news and exciting things Tesla is doing to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. If you have already subscribed, welcome back. If you are new here, please click on the subscribe button. Don't forget to like and share our videos. This really helps us thrive as a channel and continue making great videos for you every week. Today, we'll be talking about Tesla's upgraded BOT 2022. Elon Musk has revealed Tesla's 2022 upgraded bot. Since Star Wars grabbed a grasp on science and young culture, this has been the number one subject on everyone's mind. And it's suddenly back on everyone's mind, thanks to Elon Musk's recent announcement of Tesla's insane new updated bot. AI robotics innovation for Tesla isn't the first automaker to consider the benefits of robotic help. Honda was a pioneer in the field with its Asimo series of walking robots, the first of which appeared in 2000. Hyundai Motor Group has lately invested heavily in the industry, including acquiring robotics company Boston Dynamics last year. So, how does Tesla aim to surpass such well-known competitors? A neural network training computer, Dojo was introduced at Tesla's AI Day presentation. Consider it a sophisticated computer that learns how to perform tasks independently, without the necessity for explicit programming using established methods, by analyzing data acquired over millions of miles of driving. Over-the-air upgrades might then be used to provide Dojo-trained software to Tesla vehicles. Tesla is developing its own computer processors to power Dojo, the latest known as D1. The device, also displayed at AI Day, features a 7 nanometer manufacturing process and a computational performance of 362 teraflops. Tesla plans to place 25 of these chips on a single tile, with 120 of these tiles aggregated across many server cabinets to give the processing capability required by Dojo. Following several crashes between Teslas with driver assist mode engaged and roadside emergency vehicles, the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration NHTSA, launched a formal safety review into Tesla's autopilot technology just days before the AI Day event. The day after the probe was launched, Senators Richard Blumenthal of Connecticut and Ed Markey of Massachusetts asked FTC Chair Lena Kahn to look into Tesla's marketing of autopilot and the more advanced full self-driving driver assist technology. If Tesla is serious about regaining consumer trust, they should focus on correcting the autopilot. The show was worth seeing on the other hand. Even by Musk's standards, it was a bizarre act of tomfoolery. A multi-purpose circus that mocked Tesla critics fed the fans raised the stock price, and provided some eye-catching headlines. The latter is particularly important given that most recent Tesla headlines have focused on a federal investigation into the company's autopilot software's tendency to crash with parked emergency vehicles. Just look at the person in the spandex suit, Musk advises, and you'll forget about it all. Next year, I guarantee it will be an actual robot. To put Musk's claims in context, Consider that Boston Dynamics, the company that makes Atlas, the world's most advanced bipedal robot, has never referred to its robots as anything other than R&D. According to Boston Dynamics, Atlas is only a tool for testing the boundaries of robotics. It is far from commercially ready. In a recent Atlas film, the team highlighted how tough it is to construct a bipedal robot and how frequently Atlas stumbles and falls. It's also worth noting that Boston Dynamics has been working on Atlas and its bipedal forerunners for almost a decade. Musk believes that in a year, he can outperform them. There is no doubt that robotics is having a substantial influence on the industry, but there is no reason to pretend that machines must appear human to do so. Musk is well known for his bait and switch strategies. Consider how his Hyperloop concepts have developed over time. The technology was announced as a railgun-like train system that would transport people from Los Angeles to San Francisco in 30 minutes or less. These objectives have shrunk with time until the project has devolved into the loop, a little tunnel through which you can drive a car if you so want. The Tesla bot reminded many of Sophia, the artificial chatbot that has been on talk shows and magazine covers. Hello everyone. I'm Sophia from Hanson Robotics. AI experts frequently deride Sophia because she relies on trickery to fool audiences. It does, however, have a mission to complete. As one of the robot's creators, Ben Gortzel, 
told reporters in 2017. Sophia works by stirring our imagination and convincing us that the future is closer than the evidence suggests. As a result of this technique, the robot generates money and media attention for its designers. When I tell folks I'm using probabilistic logic to reason about how to best prune the backward chaining inference trees that develop in our logic engine, they have no idea what I'm talking about," Gortzel explained. However, if I show them a gorgeous smiling robot face, they get the impression that AGI is indeed close and practical. Musk wishes to teach that notion to his audience, whether or not they are investors. His perspective on the Sophia approach is that he doesn't even need a mechanical counterpart to convey the concept. He only requires a spandex-clad dancer. That's what I call creativity. He has had a beneficial influence on the globe, but it has to be seen if he will make much of a noble vision, and right now, confidence is low. Remember that Elon Musk mounted the stage and promised that Tesla, whose driving assist software can safely avoid parked ambulances, will soon build a fully working humanoid robot. Musk claims that the computer will be able to follow human commands such as, please go to the shop and bring me the following products. Yeah, I think we can do that, he replied after presenting these scenarios. And he did it all with a spandex-clad dancer. We've given you a lot of information on the display without truly addressing it in depth, but that'll change right now. Elon Musk unveiled the Tesla bot, a humanoid robot that employs the same artificial intelligence as Tesla's self-driving vehicle fleet. The Tesla bot that was exhibited, on the other hand, was simply a dancer with body paint standing in for an actual prototype or demo. Musk revealed limited details on the somewhat scary, Slenderman-like robot beyond a few PowerPoint slides during Tesla's AI Day presentation, which ended with that surprising announcement. He anticipates that the 5-foot 8-inch robot will weigh 125 pounds and be made of lightweight materials. Its head will be outfitted with the autopilot cameras used by Tesla vehicles to scan their surroundings, as well as a screen to display information. Inside, it will be controlled by Tesla's full self-driving computer. It's designed to be nice and traverse a world meant for people, Musk joked. The robot made its appearance after a 90-minute presentation explaining some of the artificial intelligence advancements powering Tesla's electric vehicles, such as the Dojo supercomputer, which helps train cars to navigate city streets without human assistance. It makes logical to put it into humanoid form, Musk said. On three presentations outlining the Tesla bot's desired qualities, Musk made a point of emphasizing that you could both outrun and overpower it. He has previously spoken out against using robots as weapons and warned of the perils that artificial intelligence AI, may bring, referring to it as the biggest hazard we face as a civilization. We should be concerned about AI, Musk said during a question and answer session following the presentation. What we're attempting to accomplish here at Tesla is create usable AI that people enjoy and that is absolutely wonderful. According to one presentation, the Tesla bot would eliminate dangerous, repetitive, and monotonous activities, and Musk provided an example, stating the robot might be directed to go to the supermarket and get the following goods. Although such a chore is not very dangerous, you may find it tiresome and boring. Musk, who is notorious for making outlandish predictions, chimed in on how he sees Tesla bot influencing the future of work. I feel this is going to be incredibly profound, he said. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, if you want to see more about the innovations Tesla is putting in place to make the world a better place, please subscribe to the channel.